ratings are more than TNSC are as follows. Mandatory match rules, no ninja holding. Maximums of three heavies, two medics, one archer, assassin, mage, and pyro. Which also means that Necker is unrestricted and unlimited this match. So, Ooh. we'll see if anyone busts that out. Probably oh, Dan. Yeah. I can I can see Dan pulling that out. <laughs> this possibility. Uh, not on this map, though. I Old Necker was more dominant. Old Necker was all right on here. With a soldier raising in popularity recently, it's not going to be seen So before likely. we do start out, we don't have the usual leader of Pudgy here on offense. It's going to be interesting to see how their offense does coordinate. Do you see Elmo as well as uh, Doodleberry there? So that they have, be very yeah, they have Mitch, Kalig, and Elmo, though. Oh. So one of them will be going medic. <laughs> Great. Ouch. Uh, Alrighty, Dan is on Lisa Fam. Surprised they're putting Lisa Fam on offense instead of defense. That means that Florence will be the only. Well, the main PvP around the defense. I'm mostly playing uh, Assassin actually dies of fall uh, damage there after <laughs> Assassin. Probably. <laughs> she probably was gonna do that anyways. Doodleberry with the kill into the pyro, going to get a took a bit of damage, but actually not the most in the world. Did a nice job onto the pyro there. Yeah, so Doodle is on offense since uh, Pudgy's not playing, and then they that probably have is. who they have on medics. That was headshot. Oh, they have Lisa on medics. Doodle and Lisa, as well as Wadden. No, Mitch. Mitch was so a very defense. Which is going to be able to get to the medic right here if she needs, but that was an insanely clean steal. TNC doesn't have any soldiers on defense, and so they rooted for a mage. Not sure how well that's going to be. So Kaliga's playing doing... Pyro defense, which he did do yesterday in the practice, so... Yeah. Pyro coming up in front of Mitch. Not sure if they see the Pyro as well as the Assassin, but doesn't look like they'll be able to get there just in time. Yeah, she's okay. going to have a lot of space here. Amber is trying to move into position, but this is some interesting routing by Mitch. She's relatively safe at the moment. Uh, this yeah, is like Amber only has stage. one shot with the route she's taking. Mm -hmm. Nobody on to Amber pressuring her yet, and Mitch is getting to a new that spot, and there's the headshot. Ooh. Ninja die from... Ninja dies. Die. Headshot's not able to connect. Did she die? Oh no, she ran backwards. And Dan... That is, uh... Awesome. Not Fire very well two. played by our... <laughs> as um, well as TNSC. TNSC could've played that a lot better. Yeah. Yeah. Um, this is going to be the first capture. capture. <clears throat> Sloppy overall, to be honest. Uh, forms could go down here, but it's not going to. That headshot never should have happened. Like, Mitch took her out where, like, better she had one shot until she got past. And the second she went around, someone should have been on the archer. And it's not like they didn't know she was there. Like, Mitch took a specific route. Like, <laughs> is that you, Brandino? To avoid the archer. Brandino, is that you changing that or is that chaos? I swear. Which one are you? Is that? I wanna see you. <laughs> oh, I gotta find- I gotta solve this mystery. Nikki hates the map, and with good reason, cause this map is this map. Hey, but at least it's on opposites. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah Misky has much. Vietnam flashbacks. Pretty much the only teams that like this map are TT and R1. Looks like a pretty nice clear here by RR, but as I say that Phoenix Quads is going to get the frenzy off of the chemist. Just the medic is left. Nice shot there by TNSE. They really should try to invest into a soldier on defense, so it is one of those very important things. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Oh, that's been oh shit, it's version CTF. Yeah. Alright. Alright. So yeah, ours is looking strong, and this is their map pick, so... And they also have a lot of people in their off rolls, you know? So, and they're already looking very strong well, for yeah. them. With that being said, TNSE isn't exactly a team I consider the, like, equal caliber. But they are missing so. a lot of members as well. I do think TNSE has the potential to be one of the, you know, more up there. Just their team work doesn't seem the best at the moment. They're still trying to get yeah, that team. Well, yeah, I don't think our playing off rolls is really mm -hmm. impacting them a ton at the moment. Uh, I mean, they've been, yeah, I mean, they, they have been people on they have people on like main classes basically, except for Kaleg who's playing Pyro. But like <laughs> Sam being on chemist offense isn't crazy. Sam plays a lot of chemists. It's just the fact that he's on offense at the moment that's different. Mm -hmm. Taking an interesting route there, probably could have gotten knocked off by a ninja, but no one was there. Uh, that being said, there's an ninja in front of him. He took a bad route, actually. The ninja waited a bit too long instead of going to knock him forward there. Don't see anybody. Yeah, ninja, ninja, ninja followed him into the uh, the corner there. 
Summer knocks with a steal. The medic is there, but got a sass. That's gonna that's be a second capture. Yep. R so on a rampage. Yep. Yep. <laughs> As to be expected, considering no one likes Pagolas. Yeah. So TNC has almost no roaming defense. They're all situated into the flag room. And as they were able to clear them one time, a single distraction will basically guarantee an easy steal. Yeah, oh they have no goodness. roaming besides Dan, I assume. No, da comes no, Dan is going to be the MVP of TNC, and he's going to try to elf cap. So does R have an archer? I do not think they do. But Amber's playing strictly defense, so as they run by, they're having a soldier slapper a few times. Seems to work. With their current roster, it may be better for them not to run an archer, to be honest. Right. Uh, only like person... Dan. Oh, yep, Dan's Dan out. Dan's Dan out. Oh. They're gonna get a follow-up to by Summernox, who's gonna go up right into the pyro. That's not where you want to go, buddy. Oh, he's, he's but, out, but he's but he super low. Sepernox is dead here. Yeah. yeah. Oh, but that leaves a steal from Cardona. Alright, three steals from TNC. Can they get past the enemy spawn? The medic is very far behind him. He's don't think the medic realizes and instead is going to the flag room. Not medic really sure. should be like respawning and like getting but over. But if here. there is one thing that Cardona Miss does, does drop, it's flag is so she got knocked off. This could be past the TNC if Cardona gets help, but there was no help. But he got. But he will climb into a block. No one on yeah, TNC yeah. got anywhere close to Cardona there. That was a pretty big misplay on their part. They have three steals, and whoever stole first and died should have just swapped to Medic and started heading over. They would have been able to get there in time, and... TNC is yeah. not in their flagger right now. The Pyro just got killed as well. Medic and Soldier getting by at the moment. Pyro did die, though, so that means they can get to the flagger a bit closer. Looks like here they come, but I only see the pyro in the mage in the flag room. Not sure how that's going to go for them. I think one of the soldiers did just die from the headshots, though. Assassin is back here. Right, it's not going to be hit by Assassin right there. I'm hit on our side. Cardona is um, shifting and preparing to steal. As I said, the distraction, everybody's inside of the flag room. One distraction is an easy steal. And as I, you know, I said that, and Mitch just showed that exactly. She is running onto the side. She does have to worry about this mage here, but mage doesn't have the most damage in the world, but yeah. she does need to worry about Karen that. playing mage, which is pretty interesting, because this, all things said, outside of the actual flag area, this isn't the best mage map. <laughs> and... And Gardona is... Mage also doesn't have mobility. Uh, if Karen was ninja there, that would have been a recovery. very serious damage, and he's dead. But something we should uh, discuss here is that they're running the mage, which again, like I said, isn't that effective outside of the flag room. And the fact that this year, that would have been a recovery if that was an engine instead of a mage. Right. Um, mobility is a big thing, and that's one thing, that's a problem like Annie has, is since you only run like one ninja or soldier, right? If that ninja or soldier dies, and someone dies on high ground, we can't recover. That's exactly yeah. what we're seeing here from TNSC. TNSC has got a soldier on recove. Nice juke there by Doodleberry, getting, being able to get past Semperanox on Soldier. Not many people onto them, I don't see the Archer in position, this is going to be looking like the third capture here for TNSC. Archer is, is actually now, but it's a bit too late. I mean, uh, Yeah, so as you see this third cap coming in here, that reminds me that during the first cap, actually, we saw the same thing. Where the ninja died and no one was in position to recover, because they had that mage instead of a second, uh, either ninja or soldier. So that mage isn't currently working out for TNSC. Uh, two of those three caps could have been prevented by running another uh, damage dealing class. Mm -hmm. Our GPS. Oh so, god, blackout. <laughs> and okay, so we're now in the blackout. Uh, R will have to run an archer here. Um, mm -hmm. Or should run an archer. Yeah, but, uh, but Amber has been playing strictly defense, so they won't be pressured too much. Kulig is playing archer, it seems. Ah. Hmm. Alright. TNSC at the same time is asking who their pyro is, and they're responding with colleagues, so they're gonna be thrown off here a little bit. And then there's the MH asking if he wants to play Elite. <laughs> Alright. It's looking very promising. Yep. That's with the bringing of, of MH. MH might just play. Not sure what I'll play. Should we lock? Yeah, I'm locking already. Okay. Sounds good. Uh.
<laughs> Amber abuse top. Will be interesting to see if she can, uh, or if Kali can go up against her. Amber is very experienced, but I've seen Kali play Archer before, and he's not bad. You know, Kali at- is one of those people that's at one point in time mained almost every class. Mm-hmm. And if Kalik does a bad job, then I'm sure they can just sub in Brandy in now or something. Oh, well, I mean, like, it's extremely difficult to do a bad job as Archer on Blackout, though. Yeah. If Amber somehow beats him, like, straight up 1v1, which I don't expect because Amber plays defensive, and I I honestly think that Kalik can take her in a 1v1, <laughs> um, he can just move defensively and sit at spawn and be just as effective because of the way the map's set. Right. They probably aren't going to run into each other either. I mean, Amber has a very defensive play Yeah, style. so Kalik's going uh, directly up top, whereas Amber is playing defensively, as expected. Uh, mm-hmm. She is up top, but she's out there a lot slower. She's now fighting with Kalik. Yeah, it's the first archer battle. Kalik is shot there because he's trying to, trying to kill the soldier. Yeah, he was going for the soldier instead. That means mm-hmm. that Amber might be able to move up there, but instead she's moving right back to defense. Smart call as the rest of the people are here. They now Before do have a Severnox is now a soldier defense, but that means that Hamza can get a really clean steal. Archer is trying to put some pressure on, but there's a medic on XX set if they need. But Hamza didn't really take that much damage, probably doesn't even need it right now. He's going to be running down into the medic now, but the Archer isn't a yeah, uh, yeah. Nice job. And Pyro frenzies after everyone is dead. So, I mean, right, so I'm going to steal. Gonna steal. Yep. He is soldier. Yeah, she's soldier, but she's she's taking a lot of damage in the She stayed in there a lot longer than she would have liked to. Yeah. However, that being said, she does have a lead, and there's no ninjas up top to stall her at the moment. Ninja she's gonna get support here actually from the elf, blocking the headshots and shots are coming close. Down to a medic here, this will likely be capture. Really badly played by TNSC. Do they see the assassin? Yes, they do. So this is on TNSC to recover here. They actually have a pyro on the corner here. Oh, uh, but, but they did not have frenzy. That's not the best play. Pyro didn't have frenzy. Probably should have waited in flag room or tried to kill the enemy pyro to get frenzy and then go. Yeah. She actually does get frenzy there, which is honestly a misplay on RS part, but it doesn't turn into anything. Mm-hmm. And that's gonna be captured. It's not gonna the flag by the ninja. And we are 1 0 on Blackout for Radiance Reborn. Uh, that capture is gonna be followed up by a quick steal from Hamza, who is going and down he middle. Is, uh, stealing as Assassin. Uh, from the soldier. The problem I think he's stealing his assassin here is that a non in skill will not recover on Hamza here. Uh, that being said, and Nikki dodges them, dodges the soldier, and gets the. She should probably hand off. Oh, she might die here to Lawton. So Hamza was frenzied by Fianca's, right? And Lawton dead. Um. Oh, yeah. Thank you. So a little little food for thought here. Uh, Hamza did get frenzied by the enemy pyro and hit once. And after the first hit registered, Hamza staked and got lightened away by Karen. Karen might get hit down here. So... Yeah. Ooh, very yeah. close. Oh, no. Hamza has to be careful near this edge, actually, with the mage here, but the mage is going to go down soon. Yeah. Oh. Did That's recovery. Medic, and medic ran away from her. Medic ran away from him for some reason. Oh, damn. Yep, that's going to be a second capture there by Hamza, rushing it very fast into... <laughs> And Mitch steals is out of soldier. But get off. <laughs> oh boy. Monkey. <laughs> oh. <laughs> wow. Gamer, I didn't say anything! I've never even talked to Dan in like the past like four months. Alright. So, we see you steal here from Elmo Cookie. Uh, she will be heading down middle, or trying to at least. Gonna get four storage XX here, which is probably where she wanted to go anyway. Uh, seeing the medics here. Uh, no restore yet, actually. But, uh... Almost. Uh, an assassin. Right? A good assassin. They're dropped on the assassin. Well, this looks like they will open up a really good steal opportunity. Medic hits the soldier as the frenzy came out. Nice, there. nice job there by Lisa Pam. I'm just gonna steal, run directly on mid, and get assassinated. Just as Nikki's assassinate comes back up, actually. Mm-hmm. TNSC is playing this map a little bit better, but ours offense is just overwhelming them right now. 
And that's a good section, but not good enough. Yeah. So, uh, Doodle is actually gonna take, like, a couple hearts of damage there for the mage, but the mage again knocks the chemist away as the frenzy goes off. Assassin is able to make up for the mistake. However, that's gonna lead to a clean steal from Hamza. I'm just trying to get up. Medic is here, but stuck in one of their own webs. That's nice a freeze. really good wow. freeze. Wow. Huh. Uh, and there is follow-up there to knock her back, so that's a really good play, actually. And Hamza's got... You know it's an impressive freeze when I comment on it. Alright, <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, so Hamza's taking a lot of damage here, actually, and has taken Flag Poison recently, so it's pretty low. Going to go through the tunnel to spawn, take the safest area, avoid taking any damage, which likely means that he is very low. The medic is being spawn camped by two ninjas, but the problem is those ninjas aren't able to deal damage to Spike here and kill him because they're on the medic. Mm -hmm. That being said, Hamza has been about a minute and a half without a medic and is currently running away from his medic. <laughs> uh, but gets knocked back in by the ninja. <laughs> Dan Amber's goes down. I see an assassin. Yep. Who is Amber's the only other one? Rico. Amber's trying to find a good spot, but the pressure. Yes, yeah, so we see away. a pirate on bottom here, actually. Who is going to go down? Hamza should capture this flag and stop focusing on fighting the enemy soldiers. <laughs> and that's exactly what will happen. So, three zero for RR on blackout. Uh, five minutes and forty-five seconds in. Another quick steal here from Elmo. Uh, TNC really isn't grouping the defense. Good lightning there by Aaron. Uh, but it doesn't really come up as much. There's no one there for follow up damage. And free spell did eventually end up missing, so the mage could not stall any longer with both spells on cooldown. Okay, Elmo's getting knocked towards the flag. And so we'll cap this before there is any yeah. chance of recovery. Okay, so 4 0 for our uh, two caps in the last minute and a half. And Hamza gets a clean seal. Hamza gets a clean seal, exactly. Where is the pyro? The pyro's, <laughs> pyro's not... bottom mid. I... <laughs> the pyro didn't make it back to the flagrant before Hamza. The pyro should have respawned quite a while ago. Please do the bar uh... throw here. Please do the bar throw here. They're doing the bar throw. Please, please, please do the bar throw. <laughs> Oh, no. Oh. Oh, they're not they're good. So Amber is stealing. I'm assuming they're doing all soldier offense. Yes, they are. This is looking really damn juicy. <laughs> this is game. They're going to be recovered on here shortly. Yeah. Unless the soldier picks it up. Nope. And... <laughs> the hams go. Oh, hams gets frenzied. Oh, oh baby. Pyro is, Pyro is hitting the medic. <laughs> Uh, I'm like taking quite a bit of damage since the last time he was restored here. Uh, but I don't think it's gonna matter. I don't need this point. Mitch, good mid air recover there. Oh my god. <laughs> Drop to and the pyro, who's running. And yep. cap. Almost got a car on there. 